this video i'm gonna show you some simple method to optimize your ping in fortnite chapter 4 which is revealed by pro players so guys make sure to watch my this whole video and in this video i'm gonna show you some tool and some settings for your windows which will help you to getting the lowest possible ping in your region in fortnite chapter 4 so guys welcome to my channel if this is your first time here please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel turn on the bell notification and with wasting any time let's go straight into over this video so guys in the first step you have to go straight into your window settings click on the window icon go for the settings option and now go straight into the network and to the internet settings once you are here now you need to go for your network reset option and make sure to reset your all the network settings before doing or using the streaks and this is really helpful you can check it out here this will remove then reinstall all your network adapter and set other network component back to the original settings so just reset your all the network settings so once you reset your all the network settings and restart your pc one time then you need to download the these tools on your PC. Link available down in the description. So you need to open up the link from description that will take you onto my this website. And you need to go straight into your uh, website search. And first, you need to search here TCP and press enter. And here you will find out TCP optimizer free download. You need to open up this article, scroll all the way down, click on this download button, and download this application. Now again, go for your website search. And now this time, type here DNS and press enter and download DNS jumper, lower your ping. Scroll down, click on this download button and download this application also on the PC. So once you go to the TCP optimizer, so you need to right click here and run this as administrator. It is the most important option. And once you run this software as the administrator, so here you will find out this kind of the settings, general settings tab. So you need to open up general settings tab. So first here we go to our connection speed and you need to set this slider onto all the way on the right side, which is the 100 plus MB. Now you need to go for the custom option and now you need to add here your network adapter selection. Add here your network adapter which you are using. Go for the congestion control provider. Click on this drop down and set it onto the CD GP. Now here on the right side you will find out checksum of loading. You need to set it onto the enable and apply the settings. Now click OK. And once you apply the settings. It will ask you for reboot click on this no button go for the advanced settings and now you need to exactly follow same settings on your pc so first here we go to over max connection per one zero server set it onto the 10 max connection per server set it onto the 8 then here is the host resolution priority local priority 4 host priority 5 dns priority 6 and net bd priority onto the 7 now here we got our transmission you need to set it onto the default whatever you have into this application then go for this type quality of the service here is the kos do not use nla set it onto the optimal one that here is the most important settings which is the gaming tweak and the network throttling index most of youtubers are doing the settings wrong and because of that you are getting the high ping and the packet loss issue on your game so you need to go for the network throttle index set it onto the default and then here is the uh, system responsiveness. Mostly people go with the gaming zero, but I suggest you to go with the optimal and the normal settings. So now you need to go for the gaming tweak, set it onto the TCP ACK frequency, set it onto the disable one, TCP no delay, set it onto the enable one, TCP Dell ACK ticks, set it onto the disable zero. And here is the network memory allocation, which is a large system cache, set it onto the default zero. Then here we got our dynamic port allocation, Next user port set it onto 65534 and TCP timed where delay set it onto the 30. Now again click on supply button. You can also save the backup on your PC. Click on this OK button and here it will also save the backup on your PC. Now it will ask you for restarting your PC. So restart it right now. So guys, once you restart your PC, now let's go for our next step and which is the DNS jumper. You need to open up this folder and inside here you will find our DNS jumper exe file. Double tap here and this application will help us to finding the nearest and the best lower latency server or the lower latency DNS in our region. So you need to go straight into the fastest DNS option, into this DNS jumper option. Now click here on the start DNS test and it will start testing all of the server, all of the DNS available in your region so guys once this testing is complete so here you can find out here we found our best dns in our region which is the au cloud flare dns and we are getting just 20 milliseconds of the delay and here you can also find out here this is the best so you need to click here on this apply dns option and this will apply this dns in your window settings and for checking this dns settings you need to again go for your window settings go for the network settings go into the change adapter option 
right click here go for the properties and then you need to go for the internet protocol version 4 and here you can check it out here we are using the same exact au cloud flare dns click ok ok again close out your the settings now launch your fortnite and you will get lower possible ping in fortnite chapter 4 in your region so i hope so guys you love this video and this optimization please make sure to subscribe to my channel if, if you want to get more interesting videos like this so please make sure to subscribe to like on this video and till the next video peace out